Hello, I just wanted to make a video to show off my aquarium setup. So I have a farmhouse style theme in my home. I really wanted my 75 gallon tank to blend in with my theme. So I went ahead and I got my stand online at PetSmart. It's a white wash wood and it has these really cool sliding doors. So you could actually have it set up like this if you want, or you could have it set up like this. It's really up to you. So I've got mine open like this, and this is where you would put your canister filter. You've got the cutouts and there's cord management in the back. I have a hang on the back filter, so I don't need any of that. So for me, this whole bottom is storage. All three shelves are movable, so you can adjust the height of them. By the way, this is not a sponsored video. This is just a product that I found and purchased myself. Um, the tank I got at Petco, they tend to keep 75 gallons in stock, so it's really convenient to just head on over there and pick it up and bring it home same day. The lids are purchased separately and it comes in two lids in a kit. Um, the light I purchased at Petco and it's really cool because it has this remote. Um, so you can actually change the color of your tank. So you can have green, blue, a soft white, a red, an orange, a purple, a pink, and a yellow. Um, your sand should be white or a white gravel to really make the most out of this light. Um, it wouldn't be the same if you had a different color gravel. But for me, I always have white sand in my tank, so. Um, you can also have the white LED light on and then just tint the background color. So you can have a combo of the white LED and a purple or a blue or a green and just switch it up. Or you can shut the whole thing off and just have a moonlight on, which is also cool. Um, the light is also good for plants. So for, for um, aquatic plants, it's supposed to help give them everything that they need as far as lighting requirements grow, go so that they can grow. Um, I prefer my plants on top. Um, anybody who has fish tanks knows that you need to have plants to have clear water. It's, they go hand in hand. So if you want no maintenance plants, um, your best bet is to get some pothos and there's so many varieties of pothos that you can get. Um, or I have a philodendron, Brazil, I have arrowheads, um, a wandering Jew. This is a snow queen pothos. Um, I've got a jade. You can, any of these are fine. You can buy them basically anywhere and gently unpot them, rinse their roots out, and then dip them into your tank. And they'll be happy. Your tank will be clear and clean. Um, and they give you air. So it's a win-win for everybody. <laughs> but um, if you really wanna get into aquascaping, Lighting matters, so um, if, uh, who knows, I might be, you know, going into that realm soon. Um, so yeah, it's a 75 gallon, I have a community tank, so um, Molly's, Platy's, I've got black skirt Tetras, um, of course I've got Corey's, where are my Corey's at, there's one. Um, yeah, I, they are live bearing fish, so I, I have a makeshift screen over the filter intake there just so that um, babies don't get sucked up. Um, this is my little nursery in the corner here, so I've got a lot of uh, plants close together and I've got a floating one up there. So there are a couple baby mollies in here right now. I don't know if, oh, there's one. Yeah, so they like to go in there. Actually, at nighttime, my platies prefer to sleep in here. All of them, they just get right in and they just rest on the leaves and sleep. 
Um, but yeah, so I do have a fry tank. So this setup is basically to kind of capture any new fry that happen to be born before I can get to them. So yeah, so this is my tank. Um, I really wanted my, my tank to just blend in with the rest of the house and look nice. Um, it's my favorite part of my house. You, you walk in the door and you're like, wow, look at this. Um, I love it. And yeah, that's basically it. So I just wanted to make a video. If there's someone else out there that is like, all right, I want to have a big tank, but I want it to be beautiful. I want it to be stylish and really um, be um, a centerpiece of my home. This is a stand I recommend. So um, that's it. All right, well, thank you for watching and I hope you enjoyed.